Hello and welcome to another live view, live stream of Similo. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Let me introduce you, my friend and colleague, Ale. Hello, Ale. Hi. Hello, everyone. Hi, hi. Hi again. And let's welcome also a game creator, of one of the creators of the game, actually, Mr. Yalmar Hak. Hello, Yalmar. Hi, everybody. Happy How to are be you? here. Fine, thanks. Okay, sorry, I was... I had so live good. open in another tab and I was hearing myself talking. I said, well, I usually don't hear myself so much. So, hello and yeah. welcome. Welcome people out of Spiel Digital. We are live at Spiel Digital. We are also live on Steam. Uh, how do you call people on Steam? Steamers? Is there Steam guys? Steamers. Steamers? Yes. Steam well, welcome gamers. Steamers. Welcome gamers. Yes, absolutely. Uh, we are live, as I said, at Spiel Digital and also we are having... Um, a sale on our digital uh, media. Alec, correct me if I'm wrong. Yes, we are um, on YouTube, Twitch, yes. and Facebook. Okay, so you can find us here. Make sure to follow us, Horrible Guild, on social media if you want to see more of this content. And welcome, Yalmar. How are you today? Yeah, kind of tired, I must say. <laughs> it's, when, it's Friday, of course, yeah. yes. Yeah. And it is... It is 6 p.m. down here in Italy. I don't know where you're watching this, but yes, it's it's been a long day and out of a long week. So, well, it's almost yeah. over, right? <laughs> yeah. And why don't we celebrate by playing some Similo? We are we currently launched the spooky DLC for Similo, both on Android and iOS, and of course on Steam, where you should be watching this. So uh, it's available for sale right now. And let me remind you that we are live so we can read your comment. And if you want to help us uh, or just comment about the game and comment about my haircut or Yalmar's haircut, for example, just write it down in the comment and uh, we will read it online. Or the and let's say, <laughs> Let's say hello to Melo that says Yalmar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's some somewhat the correct pronunciation. So very good over there. <laughs> All right, so we we uh, we we played Similo yesterday. It went pretty bad. We are two out of three losses. So let's try better this time, folks. Let uh, folks at home hope. <laughs> let's hope we don't embarrass ourselves again. Help us! Help us in the comments. <laughs> yes, let me just share the screen here. Yes, as you can see, we are planning to launch a new games of Similo. Uh, we're gonna quickly, very quickly, explain the rules. I think. Okay, just mellow one spookies plus history. Come on, we barely made it out of one spooky deck. We're, we're not ready that, yet for that. That's that's kind of the hardest combination of all. I yes, mean, but since history. you asked, we may try it later during the stream. So stick around. So Similo, Ale here choose one of the characters that you see in front of you on my screen there uh, secretly. So we don't know what he choose. And he has to give us clue by playing other cards, but he cannot talk to you or to us. Well, he can, but he cannot talk about the game. And he will have to play cards either similar or different from the secret character and help us eliminate all the non-essential character. Was that correct, guys? Did I do real well? Yeah. Yeah, I say it's <laughs> yeah. pretty fair yeah, job. It's yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so the point is okay. for, for every card uh, Ale will play to give us a clue about who his secret character is, uh, we will not know in which sense he's intending that. So it's similar because it's ha it has similar hair, because it has a hat, or maybe because it's a historical character, or maybe because it's an older character, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So we have to kind of guess his mindset when he's playing those uh, clues. So okay. you will see us struggle very much. Let me remind you, folks, that we have a giveaway currently going on for Spiel Digital. Uh, you will find the link in the comments. Uh, make sure to follow it and subscribe. You can win either Unicorn Fever or King's Dilemma or Similo in this case. With uh, And uh, I'm forgetting Vendetta. one. Yes, Vampire Vendetta, Vendetta, the newest title. And with a bunch of promos and uh, unique items. So make sure to check it out. You'll find the link in the comment down below. From the guys that are uh, tuning in from Steam, Vendetta is a board game that was made by the uh, designer, creator of um, Subnautica. Subnautica, yes, I yeah. love that game. 
so yes, that's for the Steam guys. So they know he also <laughs> made uh, he also made um, uh, a board game about vampires. Yes. Subnautica is okay. a pretty, pretty nice game. We will talk about it later. <laughs> Among Us, not on the stream, yes. Let's go, Ale. Let's fire it up with the first clue. Let's start. I'm choosing my first clue. If you look, yes, I'm ready. If you see I me looking ready. down, it's because I'm playing on a tablet. Because the game is cross-platform. Cross yes, cool. you can play it on iOS, Android, Steam, and whatever device that you have. So let's play this clue. Are you ready, Yamari? Do you feel ready? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel ready. So let's see this clue. Oh, okay. So we have a horny here. It's it's so the secret character is different from an oni in yes. some way. So we we okay. Uh, just just a bit of background for the folks at home. So Japanese uh, horned ogre-like creature. Yes. Okay. It torment sinners and destroy human for fun. Yes, I had a hex, okay. well, a ex girlfriend like that, pretty much <laughs> like that. So, if we have another Japanese character, we could probably uh, eliminate him pretty yes. quickly. But I don't think so. Can I just can I just say that last time we ruled out the Yeti because they clearly brother yeah. <laughs> brother they're, in these guys. Here. They're brothers from from a like physical point of view. Yes. So maybe I, I see many points in yeah, common that's... with the Yeti. That's kind of a good candidate. Not to so, do body shaming of the Yeti, of course. No, no, obviously. They are, um, <laughs> they are both beautiful. Yes. <laughs> and plus, being in the Arctic, you need some, some protection from the rigid sure. weather, yes. Sure. So I would say the, the Yeti is a prime candidate yeah. for elimination. In this I'm case. okay with you. Okay, let's so shall we it. go? Yeah. Chat, if you let us hear you. If you have any comment, drop down below and we will read it. So let's see if we are out of the game yet. Yes. No, that no, was, you're not. That was a safe you're bet. Not out. That was a pretty safe bet. Yeah. Okay. 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 So next clue. Next clue. <laughs> Hashtag, body Hashtag no body shaming. Hashtag no body <laughs> shaming. Yes. No body shaming. No yeti body shaming. <laughs> body shaming is bad. No yeti Don't shaming. No yeti shaming. Exactly. <laughs> Hashtag yeti love. Yes, yes. Much love for this abominable creed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. So it's different from a gremlin. Okay. So let's take away some small creatures, maybe. And... Oh, these are the classic gremlin. The gremlin from the folklore, from the world wars that, yes, actually sabotage the airplanes. It's not yeah. some fantasy creatures. So that's very interesting. All the illustrations of Similo, are, as usual, are, are made by Nayad, a French illustrator. And it, it's done an amazing job with all the cards. So I just want to say hello if, if he's watching this. <laughs> uh, so so different from a goblin. Yes, yeah, sorry. So uh, maybe I think the alien is also kind of a realistic kind of creature. You understand what I mean? It, it kind of lives in reality, in our reality. <laughs> and I'm not definitely sure I get it. No, but... I mean, I mean, it's, it's kind of... Uh, and 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 the gremlins were were destroying the the airplanes, and so it's also connected in that way. But I don't think it's. Uh, <laughs> I'm going a too far. Did you got it anything from that? <laughs> no. <laughs> so we could we could. Uh, do we have a horned creature? Maybe the the, the werewolf is the, the first werewolf. thing that comes to mind. Yes. To go with the oni, I mean, uh, again to to eliminate it because of the oni. Mm. And it's. I would say the the gremlin. This guy that it's here, a goal. One, yeah, this one monster is pretty suspicious. Yeah, and and also the goal. I think it's the goal, right? The second card. Yes, it could be. So I I think the gremlin is kind of similar in in of, from a physical point of view. Always. No, I yeah, no, I agree. They're also similar color and so something. Should we discard the gram the goal and the werewolf? Hmm, let me see. Yes. Well, I'm not quite sure about the werewolf, too. Yeah, to okay. To so honest. let's do the, the goal and the swamp monster. Okay. Because it has the strange ears, right? And before we get eliminated by this choice, let's say hello to Sky Gaming mm -hmm. that says, Hi, guys. I just wanted to congratulate you for all the great games. I got Ray Rodink alone. Wow. Awesome job. Can't stay for too long. I got my own S and demos to attend. <laughs> 
Thank you. Thank and you. we at Tankama thank like you, many of your me. games. Best of luck for the future. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Thank, thank you, you very, very much. much. It means a lot to us. So okay. let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's, let's do it. The damage, yeah. the damage of our choices. Let's go. Yes. No, you're safe. Yes. You're safe. You're safe. You're Don't safe. say no. I get worried every time you say no. <laughs> Don't stand no. there. Oh. Say yes, you're still in the game. Yes. Yeah. Be yes, positive, uh, you know, positive. <laughs> No, Sorry. you are not out of the game. That's what that's what I mean. Why you have always to oh, be no. so pessimistic? I don't know. Well, you start with no. Nobody should start with no. No, and you yes, are not. You're still in the game. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so so let's see the new clue. Mm -mm -mm, well, I think I think among all the illustration I've seen, the ghost is one of my favorite ones. Yeah, it's beautiful. Right for now, I love the shades and the the colors. Are I also love the lovely. shape because it's kind of two dimensional. You yes. see, it, it, it like lacks uh, uh, depth, and that makes it so funny that it's like. Oh, uh, the secret you... card is different from the Yurei, which is another demon from Japanese folklore. Scary people, the Japanese. And a spirit. <laughs> it's a spirit. It's a spirit. So yes, you, definitely you a spirit. Take away the ghost. But uh, Alec, can you give us also a positive clue sometime or, or another? <laughs> <laughs> no, he's the negative man today. Just no, no, no. no. no, no. <laughs> so okay, so it's I cannot spirit. speak. You know that I cannot speak. Yes. So let's take away the ghost. He is committed, though. Yeah, it's very good. Didn't say a didn't say a thing. <laughs> Barely open mouth to say I can't say a thing. Yes, I'd say the ghost and the boogeyman, and possibly yeah. the headless horseman. I don't know the headless horseman. I would or go the vampire. They they both have long long black hairs. Yeah, but with the with the gremlin, I think we oh, can yeah. also do the 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 alien. I think the alien. Yes, I feel I feel like it. Yes, with, with that I'm, colored uh, skin and let's do this. Those I'm three. gonna select the ghost last because it's my favorite card. Yeah, let's so see. sad that he goes away. Let's see if we are still there. Yes, yeah, very yeah. good, Yalmar. Very good yes, and very good suggestion in... from Ale. Bit cryptic, but very good so far. So next hey. time we will have to 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 get rid of four cards. Yes, let's yeah. hope for a good clue. It's, it's kind round, of... you have to remove more and more cards. Except for the last one, where you just choose between Except two, but, the but they are usual usually very similar. I'm still suspicious about that vampire. He's gonna go next. Let's see what comes next. Yes. And if you're watching this at home, let me remind you that we have sales on our, our digital and you will find it on our Steam page. And also we are live from Spiel Digital. We will find our virtual boot. Oh, ah. the, return, the return of the invisible man. So so here there is a little bit of meta game because last time I played and Alessandro put out this card, I was, oh my God, it's invisible. And the vampires are invisible when they look into the mirror. You're still, you're still proposing that one. I will save the vampire now because Alepera knows that I, he knew that I would have. Does it done look like a guy of... who actually remember what you said yes. yesterday about the invisible yes. man? Yes. To uh, you? He remembers. Okay. He remembers. I think this is kind of a meta reference. So I'm pretty, pretty sure it did is. You, did you actually say meta reference in a live stream of similar? Did yeah. you just drop the M bomb? <laughs> Make a bomb. Okay. And so I would, yes. I yes. would hold on to the vampire and uh, the um, uh, beheaded uh, pumpkin. The beheaded pumpkin? <laughs> I, 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 I will go very slightly less than meta, uh, whatever, <laughs> and just say the witch has a, has a hat. She's the only one with a, with a hat. And it is the most prominent thing on the invisible end. I know but, you like to think, but he is invisible. He he doesn't have a, a head. It's yes, it's but a... it has a giant hat right there. So I'm with you with the vampire. We can keep the vampire, but okay, let's say but, keep the vampire and the look, witch. Look, he he played the oni, and the witch is pretty similar in shape to the oni. Well, he said it's dissimilar to the yurei, which is a female character. So. The witch is a female character. I'm, sti I'm still think that the vampire is very similar to she, the Eureka. The the the, the, um, 
the, I know you're rooting for the vampire, but I'm no, still but, saying uh, the, it's witch, very different. the witch also has a colored skin, yeah. like the gremlin. I don't mm. know. I, I see many, many resemblances to the, the, the different characters he put out. And and the thing is, the well, the actually, now that has no head, and the guy with the pumpkin has no head because you know what? You you just yeah. sold it to me. Yes. Okay. Okay. Uh, and I also noticed yeah. that the goblin is very similar to the witch for some reason. Maybe they are related. <laughs> yeah, know, that's it. Yes. That's it. I think. Uh, so the witch gotta go. Yes, that's for sure. Horned creature. Yes. Zombie, uh, throw them out both. And which one? The maniac. Yeah, sure. The killer. Sorry. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Do you feel I mean, confident of this choice? Super, super confident. We cannot lose. Let's... <laughs> <laughs> no, you are not out of the game. <laughs> Can you just not say no? <laughs> Gee. I did it on purpose this time. I did it on purpose. Okay. Yeah, I'm excited. So, but folks at home are watching. First on, on this Steam. This is the final watching. round, guys. Yes. This is the final round. I think you have a point with the headless thing, Yalmar. Mm. I don't know. Let's see what Ale gives us. What does us. it say about the vampire? Yes. Oh, yes. Pretty classic vampire from the folklore. Let's see the final clue. Okay. Ah. <laughs> did, did you hear the worrying silence that followed the last clue? Guys, the clowns have white on their faces and the vampire has white on his face. So kill the vampire. That's what I think. But the clown is also a mask and it is related to Halloween. Is it? Well, is the clown related to Halloween? Well, it's a costume, isn't it? Yeah, it's a costume, but the, the pumpkin man is not a costume. No, but it has a Halloween pumpkin in hand. Halloween and costume are pretty related. I yeah, but it's, it's like two steps. You have to go two steps to understand that. But maybe. But I, so, I think, look, you know they, they put the white stuff on the face. I don't know. I feel no. I feel no, I, I'm I'm still I'm still with the kill the vampire idea. Yes, I, I'm I'm mostly focusing and, on the and, and look at the teeth. Gray look hair. At the teeth. Look at the teeth. Of yes, the there's the teeth too, of course. Yeah. Well, know. let's go with the vampire then. Let's see. Let's kill the vampire. Well, you should kill the vampire. Actually, they are awful for communities. Woo! We yes. found the secret card together. Yes. yes, you're being very, very good, guys. Very good, very, meta very good, good, actually. I I didn't remember the connection between the Invisible Man and the Vampire. No. <laughs> I told you. I didn't, but oh, it was, I played I played it because he has no head, so that part was correct, Yalmar. Yeah, I had those two theories. <laughs> but one of them was correct. Let's let's focus on that. Sergio, kick off Jack O'Lantern. What do you say, kick off Jack O'Lantern? We won with Jack O'Lantern. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for being so late in giving that. <laughs> that no, no, it's not, not that late. I think I, it's just a bit of delay in the comments that makes okay. them completely okay. useless sometimes. But thank you for being here and thank commenting with us. Yeah, and playing sure. with us. I want to hear more about your suggestions. Also, he says beautiful game. So congratulations, Yammer, because it's, it thank is a you. beautiful game. I prefer the tabletop one anyway. Well, I don't know. I, I think the digital version works very well, I must say. Yes. Well, we wouldn't be able to play it uh, like this uh, right yes. now if it wasn't digital. So it, each version has its yeah. own advantages. It's it's super fun to play with your friends when you're like in a stream online. That's I mean, uh, I think it's that's that's a cool part of it that you can play with them in your game nights, even if you are at home. And, yeah, also, it's and always there. When you are at work, you get a notification and you just jump in in the, in the game. You can play it along the, along the day, et cetera, et cetera. So, yes, it has, it has its own slot in, uh, in a gamer's life, I think. And 
Sergio says, I want to see you lose, <laughs> guys. Well, Sergio, just stick around 10 minutes. Huh? You will, uh, yeah, you will probably see this very soon because we are going to play a game like Mello asked before. With yes. Oh, with a combined one. History. Yes. Would you be, would you be the suggestions now the, again? Now the question is, I will be the clue giver again, but um, do we want to use the Spooky's deck as the uh, cards on the table or as the clues? The other is history. As the clues, I would say. History okay, on the so table and clues with with uh, the Spookies deck. Okay, so history on the yes. table, you said? Eh? Yes. Okay. History on if the I table. Didn't, if I didn't screw up the setup? And my favorite, my favorite uh, mix is uh, animals and history. It's my, my animals favorite. Animals and history is very fun, yes. The most fun. I also played a few games of uh, animals with uh, spookies. It's very fun. If you use uh, animals as clues, if you use the spookies as clues for animals, it's like impossible. <laughs> <laughs> Sergio says, yes. I'm Italian. Are you from si, Italy? Si, si Sergio. Si, yes. Decisamente si. Si. Yes. <laughs> and as you can tell by our pronunciation, especially mine, English is definitely not my first language. Ooh. Any news of Vampire Vendetta? Yes, we have plenty of news, but we will update it in the in the Kickstarter project when yeah, the news came out. We have an update coming soon. Yes. Very soon. Yes. With good news, actually, because the game has yeah, already yeah, shipped good. on the boat, and you can follow the boat in the in the last update that we published. So yeah, they are the arriving to the update. Hub. Yes. But I we also it. have a new update with I, cool I, things to show. I and Ale, Ale here. Ale here is the one that actually usually writes the update, so he knows everything. Most of but... them. No, I don't know anything. Everything <laughs> but he's but not yes. gonna say anything, you know. It's a very, very straight <laughs> no. up guy. No spoilers for you. So now we have the history deck. It's one of the first edition of the game, also available uh, on physical media. So it, it is printed, and you can buy it in stores. And I must say, if I if I perform it bad with the animal deck, let's just wait for the historical tour because <laughs> it's gonna be spectacular, guys. Okay. Okay. Let's start. Let's see the okay. first clue. I don't say a word. No, you don't say a word. No. Maybe you can say something about Vampire Vendetta, but not about <laughs> the clue. Mm -mm. Take your time. It's not like we have people watching at home with this. No, yeah, I know. I it's know. very interesting to, to watch stream. Mello, guys. what did what? you do to us? This is impossible. <laughs> it's pretty hard, yes. Okay, 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 okay. Let's do this. Come on. I'll try this. We are just Let's waiting. See. See. Oh, we have Marie Antoinette. Uh, yes, Hokutai. I think it's it's the, the painter coming. of the oh the yeah wave. the wave of course the famous wave see i'm already <laughs> behind him Hipatia. that's Hipatia. oh sorry i cannot click it anymore because we have a new clue ah, okay let's go with the clue <laughs> it's dissimilar <laughs> from the yeti okay uh, okay this is gonna be tricky I, I yeah know. but you know cold places so i i would say we can immediately take away Genghis khan because he is kind of from a like cold place, <laughs> not really like, but, and he is, um, yeah, I mean, I, I think it's, it's near Himalaya. It's kind of connected to the Yeti. Yes. I'm pretty sure Ale was imagining the Himalaya when he chose this, this, uh, yeah. this clue. I would say he is the one of the he has visually most similar guy to a Yeti. So let's go. go with that and let's see if we immediately lose. Well, no, we're still in the game. No, no, you're still in the game. You're still in the game. Ah, okay. Mello, I hate you, wherever you <laughs> no, are. No, don't hate him. Maybe he's still there. I, 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 I love you in a very partic particular way. Which I'm gonna, I'm hate. gonna translate the comment of Sergio Sets. It says he has myth and fable other version of uh, similar that are available in digital and in physical format no not in digital. All, uh, myths is not available in digital myth oh myth not yes still have yeah. to come sorry uh, we all have 40 years old or something and when we play it we look like kids 
that's true, you know, right. because it, it's such a, a simple game, but it it goes so deep into one way of thinking that you can eviscerate some weird, weird stuff. It's a very fun game. Myths is very hard because actually it's, I mean, you 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 notice that you know so little about the, the, myth, the yeah. yeah the myths. No, I always do that with each. I do it with animals. Come on, the okay. killer. Yeah, the so it's killer. different from a killer. Sorry. So it's kind of all the characters in 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 the Spookies deck are kind of evil characters, right? So you always go to history and say, okay, it's not going to be the fighters or the the. But yeah, so it's it's kind of a problem. Ale, sell, Ale Melo says, <laughs> love you too, of course. <laughs> okay, so killer, killer. Let's I let's think, think about really, the name. Well, I would I would go with Montezuma. Yeah, Montezuma because of the the, of the sacrifices. Rituals, the sacrifices. Right. Yes. And, and I was, I was thinking maybe Budica. maybe something Budica. more easiest like Budica. face paint. Budica. Who is Budica? Let, let me just refresh my immense history. No, of course, it was the queen of the British Celtics. Yes, I remember it pretty well. But just for the folks at home, let's let's make them clear who are this character, of course. Yeah. So you would say Montezuma here. Yeah. Yes, I'd say I'd say yes. Let's see. Let's take them away. Let's see if we are still in the game. Yes. Yes. Not yes, bad at yes. all. Not bad at all. And and he, and he is kind of a male character, the killer. So maybe he's pointing at a female character. That's another point. i sorry, what? That the killer is a male character. Oh yes. Maybe so he's it also could be pointing female, to yes. a female character. The secret the secret character could be a female, yes. Yeah. This is very tricky, yes. Sergio says, "Okay, you you sold me on it. I want to steal and buy it. Thank you, Sergio, for the support. Sergio, come in and join us. Yes, join the game. <laughs> Let me remind you, folks, that is available on Steam, but also on iOS and Android, so you can have it on your phone pretty much everywhere. I think Ale fell asleep. Ale, are you? No, asleep? no. Okay. Yeah, no." No, no, no. The, put the image. No, I cannot because I don't want to no, see it. No, no, don't. Don't, please, don't. <laughs> don't look at me. Don't look at me. Oh, you, you, you. available. Let's see it. Ooh. It's similar to the boogeyman. This is very tricky, especially because we are live. And I'm not going to say what does it mean. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wait. Uh, click on the boogeyman. Let's read what it says. Yes. It doesn't have a specific region, you know. It does frighten children. Yeah, so it doesn't have, a, like, it's common folklore, so it doesn't indicate any, like, region. You understand what I mean? Hmm. And this is very tricky. So we have to eliminate three. We can also use the the, the previous. Old, the previous. <sighs> I remember Ali thinking that the Yeti is very furry for some reason. I always picture it just in, in blue blue skin, but maybe the fur is could be represent Virginia Wolf coat, maybe possibly. So, but Virginia Woolf is a writer, and uh, it isn't yet. The, that must the be. boogeyman is kind of written in in I don't know that there are written stories about it. I don't know. I'm trying to like. So, man, this is very tricky. Yeah, I I think we can get rid of Cleopatra because it's kind of a. A killer. She is. I mean, it's it's that times when you were at the head of a state, you were kind of, uh, you had to be a killer, <laughs> almost. <laughs> uh, oh man, this is difficult. Yeah. 
So right. then there is the boogie, the boogie, you know, the boogie. It's a, a American kind of of uh, of uh, dance, right? <laughs> Are we going there? I don't know. I'm trying to find everything. Let's save Americans. Let's save Americans. Oh, so Pocahontas. It, also, it's a night creature. Yes, of course. Yeah, it's a night creature. But who was? Yeah, actually, maybe you know, uh, artists stay up late at night, so we can. Yes, we I'm could... sure that's the reasoning that Ali followed when he played the game. It's super hard, guys. Let's try. So it's very tricky. Yes. Ah, uh, you know what? I think we can we can get rid of Cleopatra because it has black hair. I would keep the Americans. Okay. Who we have Pocahontas and and. Also, so the American and the Native Americans. Yeah. <laughs> Better specify it. So I would get rid of um, Cleopatra, Virginia Woolf. Okay. And let's go. I don't see the cards anymore. I'm yes. looking at my face. Only your worried face is visible. I, right? I cannot see the cards if you do that. Uh, <laughs> And uh, the killer, the killer, and the yeti, the killer and the yeti. Cold places, no, sissy, 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 cold places, sissy, yeah. I mean, in the Alps, in the Alps, in Bavaria, yes. Come on, let's do it. Man, this is this is hard. Ale, you have to consider all those kind of thoughts. You have to That's consider good. the boogie, which yeah. is an American dance. We are still in the game in, I, against I, I, all odds. I, I will say against all odds, we are yeah. still here. Absolutely against all odds. Okay. Uh, I, I'm kind of at peace with our fate at this point. Right. So I... And the Oni is back. Ah, uh, Japanese, Japanese! It's Okuzai! But you can also have mustache. Yeah, okay. I mean, uh, you put the Japanese character, there is only one Japanese character in the whole thing. Yes, I'd say it's a pretty safe bet. Plus, I think we can rule out at least the woman for now, the women for now. Yeah, let's go with that. Let's keep just the male guys. Ready? Yeah. The folks at home. Are you all with us? I hope. Whoa! Yay! Yeah. Let's go. I don't know how, guys. I, I, I honestly don't know how we got so far. Melo says, Frederick Douglas Portat is great. Yes, it is. As you can see, he's the, the famous orator of writer statements and leader of the abolitionist movement. Just for the folks at home who doesn't know who he is. Not for me, absolutely. And also, <laughs> what, what I like best in these cases is that the, the artist not only draw uh, a character, but it also draw a different background to each character, and the background is thematic to that character. So if you have many uh, decks of Similo, just take a look at the background, because this was one of my favorite parts of the, the entire artwork, is each background is different and thematic. I mean, also how he... How he uh copied the the wave on the background yes. i think it's great oh yeah i cannot click it, it has the same feeling <laughs> what this is going <laughs> guys i know i know it's about the hair he has no hair okay so hokuzai has to go oh, has to go. yes oh let's watch hokuzai just a second yes of course from the edo period that i remember very well from my history classes <laughs> why are you laughing <laughs> I, got, I got a Edo book right, right here I cannot show you but I have it right here my... show me. It's show one, of me. My, one of my favorite period of um, <laughs> late 70s early 80s uh, Japanese artistry yes it's one of my favorite periods yes. uh, so what you were saying that uh, Okuzashi has to go Okuzai has to go yeah Okuzai has to go I think, I think. Wait a second. Wait, wait, wait a second. Oh, Let me think. Yeah, alien. He's not an alien. He's not an alien. Well, no, no. Definitely not an alien. No. Guys, no. it's it's the hair. It's the hair. 
Yes, I think it's bye bye Hokusai, bye bye Hokusai, and let's win. I, I, you see the the rhyme. Bye bye Hokusai. <laughs> 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 Let's remove the cap before we go any further. <laughs> yeah. 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 yeah, we did it. I don't know how. I don't know how. That's, Incredible. That's, that's some professional. Uh, uh, that's professional, similar. professional, similar that's for because you. Because yes. we are professional. That's why, right, Janmar? That's because we are professional. That's that's, that's how you do it. <laughs> yes. yes, we professionally <laughs> place it. If if it will be something like the, I don't know the. Olympic game of similar would be something like this, yes. This is the, oh. the, the how do you know? How do you call the the duet? Like in the in the synchronized. Um, yeah, the synchronized the swimming, yeah. Uh, swimming, like with swimming. the with the feet. <laughs> We have, we, have, we have now the official <laughs> similar Olympic team right in front of you. Yes. Thank you Sorry. very much. Thank you very much. Let's I celebrate a little more because I like this confetti effect. On this <laughs> Yeah. Melos keeps saying Spookies plus Animal next. Oh and, my god, uh, Melos. Melos. Well, I think I think we, we still have a, we still have a, a game to, to go before we leave our folks at home. So I don't know. We do another one we can consider. No, I have I have to go, guys. Oh <laughs> shame. I was you. I was going to say that our time was probably over. Yeah, I, oh. I have Yadma kids. said it for me. I have kids. <laughs> Yeah, he does. Yes, plenty of those, by the way. Yeah, just what two. You? <laughs> well, to <laughs> me, compared to me, it's plenty. Still plenty. I yeah, okay. <laughs> More than zero, still plenty. Okay, so let's Yalmar go back to his lovely family. Let me go back to my dark room here. <laughs> and I'll let's go back thank to my you. Less dark room today. Yes, yes, slightly less spooky. Let me remind you folks at home that we have uh, currently a giveaway live. You will find the, the link in the comments down below, wherever you're watching this. And uh, it's free, so feel free to join us. Thank you, Ale, for being in here. Yeah. Thank so you, and th you've been great. I don't know how we managed to win both games, but I, I don't know. And we were with these two victories. Yes. And, and it, I, I'm satisfied for today. Yeah, it was super cool. It was super, super fun. The yeah, second yeah. game super. was even better than the first one. Yeah, uh, difficult. I, I like all difficult things. Yeah. When you succeed. When you succeed. You <laughs> <laughs> but we're professional sportsmen, so it, it was to be expected. And fun. We, are, we are live on Spiel Digital. You will find our booth, so make sure to visit us on Discord. And we also launched our special 3D uh, virtual booth where you can find us and the, the good folks at CGA and Heidelberg Games. So make sure to visit it. Make sure to drop a like, drop a comment, follow us on every social media, okay? Thank you very much. Bye, guys. Thank you. Bye-bye. And bye.